top five. John Havlicek. Who else? My top five, number one, I'm freaking 46 years old. I'm not fucking 75, so shut the fuck up. My top five, and I had to put this together in the last five seconds because I was really looking at a top five right now in the league because that's the reality that we're playing in. But my top five right now for the for the, for history, even though I think Akeem Olajuwon was actually a better player than Shaq, and I think he was absolutely a better, more talented, more skilled player, Shaq was unstoppable. Shaq was being guarded by three people exactly. every time down the floor. I have him at number five. I think he was the most dominating player we've ever seen, and we will never see another one like that again nope. because the league has become softer than fucking Charmin. And the concept of having a big mother – you know what made me so happy about that Joel Embiid game the other day when he scored 70? When he, when he, he didn't take his first three until he had taken 34 shots. Joel Embiid, I know people don't want to hear this. He's the best player in the NBA right now. Whoa. And he has been for the last three years. Whoa. Cut it out. Cut the malarkey. He has been for the last. No. Best player. He won Nikola Jokic, whatever. The best player. If Joel Embiid and Nikola Jokic played a one-on-one -on -one game, Embiid would mop the floor with him. But we play right? five on five. You're great, great, great. They're both seven foot. They're both seven foot centers. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Joel Embiid's gonna lead this league in scoring for the third straight year. Okay. He's averaging over thirty five a game. He's scoring thirty five in his sleep. Give me Joel. All right. But I love, of course. Yeah. Go ahead. Take it. I know you. But remember, you're the same person that says that guys back in the day couldn't jump, couldn't run. Jokic can't jump on a curb. Okay. So. Shaq would be number five for me. The most dominating player that's ever played in the NBA, period. Number four, LeBron James. LeBron James, oh, there you go. I'm, I'm going to actually make something that's interesting because you're boring. LeBron James is one of the greatest players on the planet of all time. He's still one of the top 15 guys in the NBA right now. Oh, my God. It's amazing what he's done. He's gonna it's amazing Larry, what he's done. going to say Larry Bird huh? is better than, George, than LeBron. Oh, my God. He's going to do it. If I need, if I base it on who do I want with the ball in their hand at the end of a game. I don't give a fuck about your passing. What? I don't care about about how you treat your kids. I don't care really? if you made your friends rich. Because that's what everyone uses in these debates. Is oh, he played during Twitter. He played during Instagram. It's forty-seven. LeBron James has been the manipulator of the narrative for a decade. Period. You can deny it. It's a fact. We all know it. He has been, has been manipulating the narrative for a decade. 100%. He's an amazing, amazing talent. I, He's one of the greatest passers we've, passers we've ever seen. Scores. Greatest passers we've ever seen. He's the greatest total points scorer of all time. He's one, he, is not the, he is not even in the top five all time in average per game. If he wanted to, I don't, he can be. Well, you could say, and, and and if I wanted to punch you in the face right now, I could, but I would. You'll lose, like and you get your ass knocked out. I, I, maybe, I, maybe I would, but I punch, I could still punch you in the face. So, LeBron James, and you want to know why he doesn't average the most points? And you can say if he wanted to. No, he, you know, because you know what? It's not in his fucking DNA. It's not in his mentality. He's not a killer. He's not a savage. He's not a savage. He. He also can't make free throws in the fourth quarter, which we both know. He's missed so many free throws in the final minutes of games, of too. tight games. Shaq it's did. ridiculous. Shaq did too. Huh? Shaq did too. What? Shaq did too. Yeah, okay, but Shaq was never a good free throw shooter. LeBron was He's never also, a good has a hand, He has a hand that picks up the ball like a baseball. LeBron was never okay. a good free throw shooter, so okay. No, no. LeBron's free throw shooting percentage drops in the fourth quarter. It's statistically proven. Because I carried it my dropped. team the whole game. All right, so he carried Dwayne Wade too. I know he carried Dwayne Wade and Chris Bosh, and he carried Kyrie Irving. I'm sorry, Kyrie Irving dropped 40 in Game Five against the Golden State don't, Warriors. Don't, 40. Don't get me started. 40. Kyrie Irving hit the game with a shot, not Le not LeBron. Okay. Kyrie Irving hit that shot. Okay. And I know you want to forget. You have the revisionist history don't of that series. Game with a shot. Okay. You want great, and you know how many great. You want to know history. how many. LeBron didn't pass the ball to Kyrie for that shot, did he? I don't remember. I know that Kyrie hit a three-pointer yeah. to win that game. I know in that series, was you you ignore revisionist stuff, Draymond Green got suspended. We Andrew know. Boga got hurt. Nah, nah, stop. Andrew Boga got hurt, and Andre Iguodala got hurt. They didn't lose one guy. They lost three off of that 
stupid ass Draymond suspension. And you want to say that the Warriors were better than the Bulls? Are you fucking high? They didn't even win the championship. So how can they be better than the 72 and 10 Bulls? Because they got the city yeah, by two of the two of the Bro, you, players you, you, NBA you, 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 you can bring... nine. Did you see the shots that Kyrie right. was hitting? It wasn't regular. Kyrie's a, Kyrie is a savage. He wasn't hitting regular shots. He was Kyrie Irving is a savage. He He's a killer. That. And he played okay. better Great. than he normally plays in and that series when they got down 3-1. Normally... Kyrie Irving doesn't Kyrie Irving Irvin average twenty seven points That's, in a game in a series I, in a season. I, I I'm with you, Rudy, right. but you let me get back to my list. Okay, go ahead. Right, let me get back to my list. LeBron James, great, great, amazing, amazing player. And I'm sure every person will call me stupid and retarded and all that shit. Go fuck yourselves again. Okay. LeBron James is a team. He has jumped from team to team to get as much and many players. He's the general manager, the worst GM on the planet. He complains about his teammates. I'm sorry. Who's the most recent one? Russell Westbrook. Russell Westbrook looks fabulous with the Clippers. Fabulous. But he was the reason the Lakers couldn't win. Why is that? They didn't mesh. He was the he was why do you think he didn't mesh? Because LeBron is the point. Because whenever I LeBron would, because LeBron has, has to have the ball. LeBron has to have the damn ball. Exactly. And LeBron should not have the ball because he's 39 fucking years old. His numbers have fallen. I know they're not. They haven't fallen off a cliff, okay. but they have dropped by four points, four or five points. His shooting percentage has dropped. Everything has dropped this year, in terms of at least since the bump, since the NBA Cup. But he's, but he's, it's just, he's just not as good. Okay, go, go say go it's not three. true. We're still on four. Next, Kobe Bryant. Kobe Bryant. Kobe Bryant's a savage. Kobe Bryant's a killer, and in my opinion, Kobe Bryant's been the best player over the last twenty years in the NBA. That's why before I, I Huh? LeBron owns what? him. LeBron owns him. Owns him. Okay, so now they play one on one. Okay. Whoa, okay. They, exactly. Now they play one on one. Ah, you don't like it when it's used back on you, right? I don't. So they play one on one. No, they don't play. Number one, Kobe Bryant six foot six. LeBron six nine and two hundred seventy pounds. They can lie about his weight and say he's two forty. No, he's two seventy. He's, he's bigger fault. than Carl Malone. Not, he's bigger fault? than Carl Malone. Who fault is that? All right. I don't know whose fault is that. I'm saying, don't sit here and sit there and act like they guarded each other. They did. But you know, Kobe, Kobe Bryant, you know, Kobe. you want to know what? And in the All Star game, when he had a chance to go at Kobe, what did he do? He passed it. Oh, I can't go at Kobe because he's going to murk my ass. He's going to lock me down. It's going to be embarrassing when this 6'6, 200 pound guard makes me fucking crumble. Kobe Bryant, yes, he shot a lower percentage. Kobe Bryant was a better offensive player. Kobe Bryant, Kobe Bryant was a better defensive player. Kobe Bryant was a killer. Kobe Bryant I would was not Kobe a better Bryant. defensive player. You know why? Okay. He can't. Go look it up. Go you, look it up. You know Go look why. it up. You know don't why. Tell me, don't, why. Tell me that, don't tell me that he can guard one through five. You know. If you tell me that bullshit, if you tell me that bullshit, you're lying. Because we're both Heat fans, and we know what David West did to LeBron James. David West did that to everybody. Don't do that. He's just, going, just, he's just, he's just guard one through five. That means successfully. Not get murdered by a 6'9 power forward who mudded him David, when they got the ball in the post. David he West, could not guard Roy Hibbert. David, so let's stop the David shit. David West had a bag. A bag. LeBron James did not guard one through five. We only need to stop people, that ball. Only people he Again, the narrative. Could, there, could LeBron guard. James guard Shaq? David West. Could LeBron James guard Shaq? Randolph. Were the only Could LeBron people. James guard Shaq? And Jason Terry after game Could four. Could LeBron – I'm asking you again for the fourth time. Could LeBron James guard Shaq? He didn't have to. Fuck play. no. He didn't have Could to. LeBron James guard, guard – I don't know. Tim Duncan. Oh, shit. Tim Duncan. Tim Duncan. Tim no. Duncan. He did. No. 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 Stop it. You're lying. Boy. You're fucking lying, Nick. Mm -hmm. You're lying, bro. So, so, Stop it. So LeBron – You just – so That LeBron one through five – So LeBron, LeBron didn't guard – Oh, my God. Go Guarding ahead. someone and doing it successfully are not the same thing. Could you guard Zach Peacock? No. You're six foot. He's fucking. You're five ten. He's six seven. Oh my god! Stop so, making up shit so to LeBron, fucking justify your bullshit. So LeBron, that was a media narrative that would push that LeBron can guard one through five, which we knew. You and I both knew that was bullshit. No, we didn't. Can, really? Because he can. You, I just put. I just put it on every plate. I just put in a mid-range level, a mid-level power forward. He could not guard. David, David West was not a top five power forward. Who else? He was a mid-level. 
Who ought, who all right. brought the physicality so then you're, that again, David again, brought? Again, again, you're you, you're wrong. Oh, so you David. just got proven wrong. No, so we didn't get proven we were, wrong. We were there. We watched it. We watched it. Okay, get, go. We okay, watched go it. I'm, all right, so I'm going to finish. I'm, I'm going to be quiet. Kobe Brown, was, Kobe Brown was a better defense player, and you know what? The stats back it up. The fact that he made all more all NBA defense teams backs it up. So next one. I'm not going to do it. Yes, Don't worry. Are. You are going to. No, I'm not. Larry Bird. Larry Bird, people do not understand how – that man won three straight MVPs in the 80s in an era with Magic Johnson and the Showtime Lakers. He won three rings in the era of the 80s. Larry Bird, if you wanted, played a game left-handed. Larry Bird had teams rolling over on their seats, laughing at their themselves because of the shots he would make. He would tell players, and there's enough data and video to back this up. He would tell people where he was going to take the shot from and say, what are you going to do about it? And he would go and make the shot right in their damn face. There's video of Byron Scott saying this, James Worthy, Xavier McDaniel, countless Charles Barkley. Like, the, there, there is video after video. This man hit more. I mean, the, the, the shots this man would hit. And remember, they played in an era where you flow commercial, where you ate hot dogs at airports. Because I know you think every guy there sucks from the 80s and sucks from the 70s. I, mean, I didn't go to the 70s, by the way. The, no, you think they all suck. Larry Bird would make mincemeat of these bums today. He would. He, would, he, he's, he was incredible. And you're, you weren't old enough to watch him play. I understand. You I weren't see, born yet. I, I mean, I, I, I know you saw clips. I saw it when it happened. You saw clips. And, it, and the fact that I you watch, see clips I should watch. give you an idea. I know, don't, don't tell me you watched the 1985 freaking NBA Finals game. Stop why it. Why didn't I? Because you know why? Why? Because you're lying. You just, said that, you just said LeBron James could guard fucking Shaq. I mean, and Roy Hibbert and David West. I, I know. They could guard Shaq. Did I like, exactly. So, the, so your entire one through five argument just went to fucking hell. You want to name so, one person that's the most dominant person in NBA history? Okay. I can, I can, I can name 20, dude. Really? And he, he can't guard power forwards in the post. He could never do it. Yes, he, he could. He could not guard power forwards in the post. Successfully. Yes. yes. Can you put his body on them? Sure. Can he guard them successfully? I don't mean a position. I mean for a game. Come on. I mean for a game. Because when somebody has to guard their it's, it's a false media narrative. But again, Larry Bird would tell you where he's going to shoot the ball from. Okay. And say what? And do something about it. The passes that Larry Bird would make, you don't see anyone make those passes today. Not even LeBron. The passes that Larry Bird made and Magic Johnson used to make back then, no one makes them today. Unbelievable. Magic Johnson, I mean, Larry Bird, to me, is the greatest small forward. People will disagree with me. I don't give a goddamn what they say because, you know what, people have recency bias to everything. And, yeah, LeBron's career, 20 years, he's unbelievable. The fact he's still playing at this level is amazing. Larry Bird's back went out on him in year 12. Shit, sucks. Number one is Michael Jordan. I'm not saying it. I don't have to say anything else about that. I don't care about the, I don't care about the three-peat, three-peat, whatever. I don't care about all that shit. Michael Jordan was the, is a killer of all killers, and and at the end of the day, what did, what did Donald? You would know this. What did Larry Bird say about Michael Jordan? He's God uh, disguised. Jesus. He's, he's Jesus, Jesus disguised. Nike. Nike. Yeah, he's like a, he's like disguise, this a guy disguised as Jesus. I don't know. Like they 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 beat him. They killed him that series. They they killed him. They won. They swept the series three zero. Yeah, they did absolutely they swept the series three zero. Bird went to great. That's not my guy. Uh, 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 hey, whatever. Uh, Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan led the league in scoring for a decade. For a decade. Okay. He left, came back, and led the scoring for three more years. Okay. okay. Let's be real. We, let's be real. Okay. Houston so, Rockets weren't beating so that fucking we go to the, the Houston Rockets. The Houston Rockets weren't going to beat the Bulls in 1995, 94, 95. No, we go to Stop. the lead in the scoring conversation. <laughs> like, yeah, his average. His, he has the highest average of all time, 30.1. point every year, like. Okay, mm -hmm. how big of a and he shot and he shot in some seasons 53 54 so, percent as a 6 6 guard. So if I'm passing and I'm getting he got hammered and tackled to the ground on every play by one team, don't do that. I hate when y'all do that. Everyone I did it. I know you're gonna say you're gonna say you're gonna show me some clips. I we had hate, open shots. I hate when you older people are watching that. the NBA all star game 82 times a season right about now. So go ahead. That hammered him. 
and y'all be like, yes. that era was I, again, again, this, this, proves, it, I, this I, proves you did not watch them because you weren't born. I watched the game. They be like, that era was so different. We got the hand check. That hand check shit means mm-hmm. nothing against somebody mm-hmm. who could play basketball because they'll use mm-hmm. your hand check against you mm-hmm. and they'll grab your arm and yeah, yeah. throw it away. So if you mm-hmm. actually so throw it away, yes, they'll throw it away. A great right. player, they know how to manipulate. Do you it. literally know what the hand check was for? It was literally used to stop your fucking forward momentum so you couldn't these drive to the players, basket. These players nowadays will grab your hand and use it these against you. These players today. You mean the players that take 53s a game? Rudy. Those players. Rudy. The ones that shoot 53s a game. I played against people. I don't give a fuck who you played against. Who would that's who you played against? You, you shoot 53s a game. You always tell me I played defense so helter skelter and I grabbed in my era right. and, and, and you did. You fouled. Okay. It's okay. And I went to today, college. today all that's a foul. I went to college and, 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 I, and, I, it. and I tried to put my arm on somebody and guess what they did? They grabbed it and they used it against me and went to the basket and laid it up. That wasn't a hand check, though. You understand that? You know what a hand check is? I know what a hand check is. You actually know what a hand check is? What's a hand check? Basketball for the Tell me, because you just said your arm. A hand check is two fucking hands. Rudy, that doesn't mean anything. Y'all keep really? thinking a hand So, so you can can I shut you out with two hands. That doesn't mean anything. You're crazy, man. Y'all keep thinking hand checks will save you. It will not save Who you. Who said save you? You just said they mean nothing. It means nothing, because other people can use that okay. against you, Rudy. I'm telling you, all man. Right, all right, Nick. So I the team. Teams today, so the teams today that are scoring 120 points a game, shooting 53s. I remember you told me that the scoring in the 80s was low. There were teams that averaged 120 in the was, 80s was, with no three-point shooting. They ran up and down. You're talking about a couple teams, Rudy. Come on now. A couple we're, we're not going to do this. Actually, we're not actually it's no, it's not a couple teams. We're not going to do every this. Team, every team in the mid-80s averaged we're 100 not points or more. do this because we yeah, know the Because you're wrong. Because you're wrong. Because you're wrong. Because it's harder to guard now. And it's, All right. It, so it's harder to guard now? Yeah. It's harder to guard now. Really? Yeah. Okay. Rudy, because you, every, you can move to the next topic because that's the most. Because everybody's not just in the paint and you have everybody one, can shoot. One everybody can shoot. On okay. The team. Everybody, everybody can shoot. Everybody okay. Can okay. Jimmy Butler shoot? Can Jimmy Butler shoot? He can shoot it well better than anybody from the freaking 90s and 80s. Really? really? Could Dwayne Wade shoot it well from the three point line? Where Wade was 10 years mm-hmm. ago. Could, could, Dwayne, could Dwayne Wade shoot well from the three point line? He can shoot enough. Would, J- would Dwayne Wade dominate yeah. today's game in his prime? Yes. Yes, and he wouldn't have to take one three-point shot to do it. But he would. No, he, he did, wouldn't. Yes, he would. No, he wouldn't. Okay. No, he wouldn't. Okay. Because he didn't do it when because he didn't do it when he was playing. He still shot a three a game or two. A, a, a three a game or two, and there was a point where he shot twenty-one percent from three-point range. Okay. Okay. And then he would. But, but yet again, we're talking about Rudy. The guys shoot. But I'm, right. te- I'm telling you, can't play, you that defense is harder today. Yeah, it's harder because you can't touch nobody. No, because you have to guard people one on one. You know how hard it is to guard somebody. No, because you cannot. You know, play, we because play, yeah. man is not just sitting in the paint because he. Has no, to you, you can't. You can't even guard, bro. You can't even jump in here to contest a shot without fucking having a foul call on you for you don't even have to. You don't. You didn't have to go nowhere before because everybody was in the paint. You have to get out the paint because your man will shoot a three in a corner. Why? Yeah. Open if you sit in the paint and you get killed. You'd be mm-hmm. sitting on the bench next to me. You, you want to, let's take a look. Let's take a look. What what is the what, let's let's take a look at what the average NBA team shoots from the floor. Oh my god. I, I mean, because you think it's that it's you the you, threat, you the threat of them making it really okay. because they can actually shoot it now. You literally you know what the average three point shot is right because now, they percentage wise? No, the percentage. No, you know what it is? Because you don't even know what it is. Rudy, you don't even know what the average is. Even even if the percentage is the same as it was back then, oh, it's, it's now a, that, oh, it's a different oh. shot now because they oh. were attacking the paint and they kicked up and they shot wide open. Let's, let's, let's keep pushing that goalpost in another direction, okay? Oh my! Because the second ago, they, they shoot the ball better, but the but the three point shooting percentage is almost identical to what it was thirty years ago, but, twenty five years ago. I, but Rudy, it's like a two percent difference. Three being shot back then to today that we know that. Come on, they were shooting wide open threes. Now they're shooting off the dribble from thirty two feet away. Are you are you gonna sit here with a straight face and tell me that guys aren't shooting wide open threes? All Rudy, day? they're shooting are you, from. Are you? I watched Cam Johnson last night miss a wide open uncontested three to tie the game it by a fucking mile that is what you see half the fucking time today. they are wide open they're all the not, time oh my god they're wide open because they generate these open shots they were they're just wide running open. people back there. Oh, a, a second ago you said they weren't open now they're generating it 
So pick your argument, They're Nick. Which one both. is it? They're doing rodeo. Oh, okay. In the 80s and 90s, okay. they were just wide open. Nobody guarded okay. them without the okay. he shot a 30 foot three. That was a bad shot. Oh, you're just gonna shoot. It's still a bad shot. No, because they can make shot. They can, Are you high? They can make it now. They can make it now. Okay. What's the next topic, Don? Because this man's out of his mind. He's, he's doing that same thing. shit. No, that can't that's be it because we because we had a we had a major shit today uh, that that popped off. And I mean, I know I gotta rant real fast, but if you want me to, I can. I can fit it all real. Listen, quick. I think you're gonna have to because we're we're over. 